Hello there, how are you doing? Welcome back to Gamer Central. So guys, in today's video, we are going to discuss Apex Legends Seasonal Battle Pass is worth it once again. Are you guys excited? So let's get started. So keep up with me till the end, comment right below this video, subscribe if you still haven't, and turn on the post notification for more videos. With the dawn of a new Apex Legends season comes new content. Broken Moon, the brand new map, is just the right size and has lots of unique locations to explore. Catalyst, the 23rd Legend, holds her own against the rest of the Apex Legends roster. And while there are no new guns this time around, players will be happy to know that the seasonal battle pass is better than it has been in a long time. Apex Legends players have long since complained about the quality of the game's seasonal battle passes. Unremarkable legend in gun skins, gun charms, and trackers galore have played the battle passes for so long that people were starting to forget when Respawn Entertainment included content that was worth the battle pass admission price. While the cosmetics in the Season 15 battle pass are not all winners, they it's more than makeup for the misses. A bright beginning. Purchasing the standard battle pass gives players several good cosmetics right off the bat. Sears Shadow Sorcerer, Boba's Astral Treasure, and Catalyst Arkham are skins that are worthy of the epic rarity as they do more than just outfit their respective characters in holographic patterns, which is something Respawn Entertainment has done in the past. As far as gun skins go, the legendary Obsidian Knight skin for the Havoc is a fine addition to anyone's collection as the iron sights make target acquisition much easier than other Havoc skins. A little after the beginning of the battle pass, players start to unlock more worthwhile rewards, a few noteworthy mentions are the legendary Apex Pack at level 5, which guarantees a legendary cosmetic item, and Horizon's O Behave Emote that has her looking disapprovingly at her enemies. Progressing the battle pass roughly one-fourth of the way unlocks Ash's legendary Imperial Assailant skin that outfits her in a red and black color scheme, complete with a dark outline around her eyes and red lipstick. The skin is a perfect fit for Ash as it reflects her merciless nature. A fashionable midway point. As players make their way to level 50 of the battle pass, they start to unlock more cosmetics for the new legend, Catalyst. Her well, wasn't that illuminating, voice line, stunning crystal cord banner frame, let's see what the crystals say Hola Spray, and eerie music pack, let players get into the supernatural feeling that the character in Season Project. Catalyst's cosmetics also let players fill out the empty spaces in her legend tab in the main lobby. While the midway point also unlocks some stuff for Catalyst foil, seer players to be excited to get Revenant's Mail Order Monster Legendary skin. Unlocked at level 50, this is the first battle pass skin available for Revenant, and now fits him in a dapper, though slightly ripped, suit and matching top hat. The skin also comes with a matching hola spray a little further down the line, and is a great way to let opponents know the well-dressed simulacrum is coming for them. Finishing off strong, the end of the Season 15 Battle Pass focuses on the remaining Apex Legends. Wraith's sweaty emote pokes fun at the fan, notion that all Wraith players are sweaty tryhards. Watson's Dracuness banner frame puts her in the backdrop of a haunted castle, complete with her signature stuffed Nessie plush in the foreground. There are also a bunch of lore-filled load screens for Catalyst that players can read in the lobby before equipping them. A good-looking R301 epic skin, called the Cosmic Guardian greets players at the end of Battle Pass, level 89, before the Nenities shower them with a second sky of emote for Catalyst and a new one for Ash. Finally, the Season 15 Battle Pass ends with two reactive skins for everyone's most loathed weapon, the Charge Rifle. For those who don't know, reactive skins change the appearance of weapons with every knock or kill. Adding more knocks or kills increases the amount of flare and animations on the weapons for the rest of the match, regardless if the players using them have been knocked or killed themselves. Reactive skins reset their progress with each new match, however, requiring players to rack up their body count once again. All in all, Apex Legends Season 15 Battle Pass is worth the price of admission. Players who want to outfit their Legends, guns, and lobby in a wide variety of cosmetics will find a use for the Battle Pass content in their games. So guys, this was all about today's video. Share as much as you can, that really motivates us to create more content for you guys. With this, we end our video. Hope you liked the video.